Events are a large part of our community outreach program. This month, we continued with our first responders lunch. We served around 40 lunches to the Brevard County Sheriff's while they were in training. We had the privilege of having Calvary Chapel come for their Day of Compassion for our beautification project. We joined the Coco Service Center as we served lunch at the Space Coast Derby Day Golf Tournament, which was a fundraiser for the Coco Office. Another joint effort was at the Central Florida Crime Prevention Meeting, where we served lunch to at least 40 officers. There were officers from at least 15 different areas, including Brevard, Orange, Osceola, Seminole, and Lake County. The Rolling Readers of Brevard County invited us to serve water to their guests at their annual fundraiser. Lastly, we were given the opportunity to occupy a large vendor space at the Great Florida Air Show, featuring the Blue Angels. This corporate space was donated by BRPH, which is an architecture and engineering design firm. The location was great as we were right in the center of everything. We served coffee and donuts to the volunteers. The air show was a two-day event where we were able to display all of the information on our programs, as well as information on all of our volunteer opportunities. On the first day alone, there was over 10,000 patrons. Being visible and interacting with our residents keeps our community engaged. Our EDS mobile canteen is impressive and the best attention grabber. Having this unit at local events is intriguing and a great way to engage our community. Being involved in these local events is a lot of fun, but it cannot be done by one person alone. So I would like to create a committee with a few board members and volunteers. Volunteers are vital to our operation. With a community events committee in place, I believe we will find a way to do the most good for our community.